Hi YouTube, so today we are going to show you an example of the newest craze going on. Yes. And at least in my yes. area of Northeast Ohio, we are doing... Um, Painting. Yep. What are we doing? Painting what? Painting a rock. We're painting rocks. And yes. then we hide them somewhere, yeah. like in a park. Yes, in a park. Yep. And then people find them and yes. they post them on yes, Facebook yes. with a picture so that yes, yes, yes. you can see how far your rock has made it. Me? All right, so the, here's our little setup here. We have about almost every main color of paint. Um, the paint that we use is at Walmart. It's 50 cents a bottle. And it is Apple Barrel brand. And there's this same brand but different prices like one's for outdoor. You don't necessarily have to get the outdoor paint. We but have all the paints. Here's all the paints we have. We have black, green, blue, yellow, pink, red, white. And blue. And green. I think I already said green. And orange. So. And blue. Yep. And we got all the main colors. And then what you need is some paintbrush. Paint brushes, really fine, skinny ones to do good detailing. Um, I'm not an artist whatsoever, so I'm not sure how the we first rock's going to come out. One too far. Hold on. And um, so you can get these at Walmart right by the paint. Put it down. Put the paint down. Right by the paint. Uh, $3.97, you get five of them. The other one, my daughter dipped into the paint already, into the blue paint, so... Um, let's start off uh, by making an easy one. We're going to make a rock. What are we going to make with this? What did I say? What's this look like to you guys? Rock. Well, to me, it looks like a good rock, rock, rock. Good rock, good rock. A good skeleton head. So we're going to do a skeleton face yeah. for Halloween. So let's go ahead and get started. Yes. When you're done painting, you're going to want to also get some uh, clear gloss sealant. Um, I got Rust-Oleum. It's called Gloss Clear. And underneath That's of it... That's really ticky. Hold on. As long as it says seals, protects, and revitalizes. As long as it says seals and protects... That's what you need so the weather doesn't take off your paint on the rocks. Because you don't know how long your rocks are going to be hanging around until someone finds them. Um, all right, so you just need paint brushes, acrylic paints, and a sealant. All right, so let's start with our first rock. This one. Okay, so we're going to very lightly. Do you need me? Yes. Uh -huh. Dip you... just the tip. You can even dump these out onto like a little like, you could get one of those little paint things like the artists use to pour your paints in. Little circles like a little, I don't know what those are called, but. All right. I think the rock. So we're going to make a. Circle. Paint it, paint it. Huh? Let the eye. Yep, it's an eye. Let the eyes. We'll do another eye. Yeah. There's a two eyes. Oh, right and there. when you after you collect your rocks, this actually looks like a good um rock. Alien. Alien? Let's do an alien. Yes. yes alien. Um, I didn't get brown or gray paint because I think that would probably blend into the rocks too much. This is really dicky. Yeah. Uh-huh. I told you I was dicky, dicky, dicky. All right. Yeah, we got a skeleton. So that looks like an alien, I'd say. Mm -hmm. We got an alien. We got an alien. When we were actually picking out rocks at the park, we found a painted one. Very, what a coincidence. So um, yeah. that that's a finished one of a person that actually knows how to draw. These, uh, you can even write sayings on them. Like, 
If you're religious, like myself, you can put like, uh, Jesus loves you, or just inspirational quotes. Yeah, Eva, they seen. So, um, yeah, you can write love, or let's get another one. You know, um, I have pretty good handwriting, so I think I'm gonna do a lot of like um, little like quotes, like love and stuff like that. So, all right. Now, before you start, one. can you hold on? Yes. Before you start painting your rocks, you're going to want to scrub them like you would, you know, your dishes at home because it's going to make it easier for the paint to stick on. So, um, that's pretty much it. We got our alien. Um, I mean, you could do more with it, but I, I think it looks one. pretty good I for what it is. Rock. I pick it. All right. So, Hope you enjoy this video. Don't forget to make sure you scrub your rocks before you paint them. And then after you are finished painting them, just spray your sealant. And it makes it nice and glossy and protects the paint from coming off from the weather. And you probably want to do this outside. We're actually inside right now, but Maybe it'd be better to do it outside. Once this dries, it won't look so dark. <laughs> All right. Thanks for watching. Hope you have fun and enjoy doing this uh, new activity. Say bye, Ava. No. Say bye. No. No shirt on. We done? Yeah.